Hello everybody, it's Sephiroth 4 for another episode of Commander Keen 4 Secret of the Oracle. In the last episode we took on the Well of Wishes and we got past the Dope Fish, which was actually quite a feat in my opinion. In this episode you're going to see a lot of fail because I'm going to take on this board and the Tar board and those are the two hardest boards in my opinion. So let's jump right into the Isle of Fire. I'm going to blaze across the Isle of Fire. Obviously, just like everything else in this game, that is a one-hit kill. But this board, that's not the uh, that's not the main problem of the board. The problem of the board is all the living rocks and that over here. Wait, just just give it a sec. Just give it a sec. That guy, Mr. Fire Lord. Oh dear me, that that Fire Lord has inspired many many a nightmare in uh, this gamer. Oh dear me. And, uh, yeah, that's a lot of living rocks, if you ask me. Um, okay, is this like a little safe zone or something? Oh, no, I'm underneath. Cool. But I need to get... No. Come on. Now let's get out of here. Where's that... <laughs> Oh, where is it? Where is it? Oh god. I'm sorry I was quiet there. I was trying to figure out where I was. I'm 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 going underneath the bottom if you can't tell. I wonder where it leads. Okay, I'm trying Oh a life! Oh no, but I have to go back there. Crud muffins, as I would say. Oh god, look, they followed me. How adorable. Um, I just, it's like, it's touch and go because you can't really see where you are. Okay, so there I am, and just run away! Run away! Run away! Hello. Yeah, just go past me. Oh, dear lord. Um, yeah, so that guy's over there. Stupid booze. I'm telling you, they're exactly like booze. You just have to you have to know how these things work. Like the fact that you have to run away. Okay, that was that was actually quite unfailish. Don't get impaled. Shoot that thing. I almost forgot. I was just standing there watching it. And where does this lead? I don't know. I was expecting that actually. Oh, and this leads past the Fire Lord. That's kind of cool. Those rockets hurt you too. The Fire Lord is invincible, so remember that. Remember that, viewers. Um. Okay. I'm actually completely. I have no idea where I am right now. I usually just like run through this board and don't explore at all because exploring is bad. When you're fighting the Fire Lord, exploring usually equals death. Like right here, if you miss the jump over there, you're dead. You're dead. Game over, man. Game over. It's game over. Uh, okay. And... Okay, so that I think that's the, the platform I activated before with that switch. But there's probably a living cloud around here somewhere, actually. So this board is pretty much blind because I would never, ever, ever explore. Dear God, and that's why. Try again. Because that Fire Lord will kill you. Yeah, he fires these little fireballs of doom, death, destruction, despair, and uh, dog. Uh, I had to. The five D's of Fire Lord. Dive, dip. Oh no, dodge, dip, duck, dive, and dash. <laughs> it's like you're playing uh, red light, green light. Oh dear god, I walked into that. It's like you're playing red light, green light. You're like red light, green light, one, two, three. You ever play that game as a kid? Like, you know, one person stands at the end of a uh, an area and the uh, people behind him have to try to get to him, but they can only walk up to him or run up to him when he's not looking. So he like says red light, green light, and uh, like as he's saying that he's facing away, uh, but 
No, you didn't. You, you've played it. All kids have played it. You have to. It's actually in the contract a kid signs when he's born. Uh, that's one of the games that you have to play. And, like, whoever catches him becomes the next it person. And... Run away! Run away! Oh, God, I love this game. It has just enough heart attacks for a small child. But it's not, like, a scary game, so they'll still play it. You know what I mean? And yeah, I had to go get that, so... I guess I'm not exploring that way again. And there's fire down there. <laughs> Look what I'm doing, I'm an idiot. There's a fire lord around here some- Oh my god, it's the end of the board! Hello, end of the board! I'm going to jump over you to see what was behind you. Stay away from me, crazy old man. Oh, come on, nothing, nothing? I wonder what was up there. Guess we'll never find out, because I'm finishing this... Uh, I wanna... I wanted to jump into him, uh, as he was, like, going into the fire. Oh, thank you so much for rescuing me! I'll return to the Oracle Chamber immediately! May the road rise to meet your feet, Mr. Member. <laughs> That's kind of funny. He says something different every time. So that wasn't too bad, but the Fire Lord can kill you. I think there's another one in the board, but I don't remember. This board is really annoying. The Isle of Tar. Um, this board is just the tar, obviously, just like everything else is a one-hit kill. We haven't seen these houses in a while, actually. But this board has an entire substructure. And I mean, like, serious amount of, of underground area. Uh, you can't- you can jump across here if you really try, but it's nearly impossible. You just, like, have to time it just right, and it's- it's not easy. It's not that easy being green, but I made it. Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 ha! And, yep, this area, most of the board is underground. And jump! No! Yeah, that is most of the board right there. In a nutshell. There's a shell. With a nut. I tried to go into the door, but he died in the going in the door animation. That was kind of funny, actually. That was almost worth the death. Almost. In a very sick sort of way. You just keep shooting, because there's going to be a whole loads of these things. Okay, I want to go get those, um... Those teardrops. That, uh... Tears of a small child. Oh, you could just do that, too. Okay, fine. That works. Yeah, so let's just go down here, because it's it's not easier. There is no easy with this board, but it's a hell of a lot easier than some. Okay, so you can go down there, and it doesn't lead to a straight death, because that would just be a really nasty thing for the game designers to do, but it does lead to a most certain death. Um, where does this go? No? Does this go up? I'm just trying to figure out why this is... Oh. Okay, that works. No, that doesn't work. I'm gonna have to go. Okay, sorry about that. I pressed the uh, the Windows button and it it it's annoying. I'm it's gonna be fun editing this episode now. Let's put it that way. Looking down. Okay. I need I needed just like a reference point. Okay, this board also has these things, which are like little killy things. You can, I think you can stun them, but, but not, yeah, see, they do that. You can stun them as they're jumping out, but it's really not recommended in any way, shape, form, or size, really, because it's not very possible. And, yeah, they're right there when you leave the room, so just, <laughs> it's, you know, this game just likes doing that to you. <laughs> I find it funny, I don't know why, but remember that there are two there. Always good to remember your numbers, kids, because if you don't remember... And yeah, it looks around, and it's so adorable as a tiny little thing, but then it's just like, haha, I'm gonna kill you. And let's see what's over here. More tar pits of death. Oh, that works. And, ooh, it leads to a switch. Yeah, baby. 
I love switches. I'm just, I'm just putting that out there, kids. I love switches. I love to toggle switches. You can take that in any way you want to. Oh my god, that thing almost killed me. Toggling switches is my life. This is, I'm... Yeah, uh, you can see, like, the... It's already, like, scariness. Haha, -ha, you missed me. I'm back. How the hell did I get back there? The doors all lead to the same spot. That is, that is, that is cheapness. Yeah. I win. Oh, no, no, no. It's a sky pest. Damn you, sky pest. As soon as I try to get to it, it'll, it'll land on me and kill me. Okay, this is... Uh, da, 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 da. Yes! Haha, <laughs> I killed the sky pest. You're dead. Ding dong, the sky pest dead. I'm gonna fall down and then I'll die. Ding dong, the little sky pest dead. Although now it doesn't really matter because I died. When you die, the enemies come back. They do come back. They always come back. When you die, I don't know why I'm still singing that song because I died and all my work was for nothing. But I like getting these little things because they make a little cling 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 sound. Should I fall down here? Let's see what happens when I fall down here. It's probably a stupid thing to do. Whoa! 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 At least there's a way out. Now I'm gonna see what's on the other side because I'll probably die in the process. Don't you love dying in the process? I love dying in the process. There was nothing there because that was another place for you to fall down. Whee! Whee! I'm getting the hell out of here. Look at me, I'm alive. Because I'm still alive. Still alive. I'm like GLaDOS, I'm still alive, man. Still alive, man! Can't kill me! Yeah, that's not suggestive in any way, shape, or form. And guess what? I have to go all the way back and get that red thing so I can get the, the gold thing so I can probably get the blue thing. Because things are fun to get. Don't you love getting things? I know you do. Let's close this before something horrible happens to me. Do do. I also love the music in this board. This board is some of the, uh, some of the best uh, Commander Keen music that they ever were created. That was a merry-go-round of not going there. Oh, dear lord, I almost stepped on that man. Who is a slug. It's a man slug. Man slug! Man slug. He's a slug and a man. Let's fall this way. Very nice. He was first a slug, and then he was a man. He's a man slug. I know a lot of people like that that can be mistaken for men even though they are slugs. Like me. Except we're all total four. Don't you go pooping clean up clean up after your dog. Obviously that is where the gold thingy goes. Oh no, fell down here again. Whee! Whee! Just going around all over the place. Don't need to walk around in circles. I'm so random today. So random. It's like so happy. Where the hell was I supposed to go again? Oh, right, there was a switch to press somewhere. Was it up here? I don't think it was. I don't think it was, but I'm gonna go up here and why? Nope. Yes. <laughs> wah, wah. Okay, let's do that again. So this, I don't know how long this episode's gonna be, but who cares? Because it's uh, this is the last board I'm doing in this episode anyway. And it's a big board, like I said. The big board. The big board. T-H-E-B-I-G-B-O-A-R-D. Is that gonna... No, that didn't kill me. I guess that's why the little thing is it. So you can't kill it. Oh my god, but it got me. Die. Die. Die, die. And let's get all the little children tears. Yay, a life. I like getting lives. That's that I think that's why that's there. It's just to like give you lives. Because it knows that you're going to die in copious amounts. Oh, that was close once again. I'm very good at almost stepping on that guy. Have you noticed? I have. But yeah, this is a fun game. I really do love it. Um, 
one of my childhood memories, and that's probably why I love it. Is it the best game? No, I can't say. There's very few games that I play that I can call the best games, but nostalgia definitely makes a game a hell of a lot better. And this game is pretty well made. So yeah, now we go over here, we jump over the creeper, and we go up there and avoid Mr. Sky Pest. Oh, no, 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 you stay away from me. Nope. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Now where do we go? I don't remember. Uh -huh. uh, let's go down there and then not fall into there. Very nice, very nice. And there's a door here. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not gonna eat me. You're not gonna. You're not gonna eat me. No, you're not gonna eat me. Yeah, that was stupid. Okay. So I think we fall down here now, right? We fall down and we don't go into the La Brea tar pits. We go up this way. Uh, I think this is not where we're supposed to be, but who cares? Let's just do that. Or oh, maybe it is. I can't remember because I have the memory of a goldfish. Actually, no. I have the memory of a dopefish. If it goes out of my sight, it doesn't exist anymore. Where does this go? Do I have this? Yes, that's the one I have. And now we have to go down. We have to go sideways. I know where to go now. Because I am smart. I am as smart as a... Old Russian proverb, strong like ox, smart like tractor. Let's close this. No, 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 no. That is not what closing means. I don't know what country you're from, Mr. Commander Keen, but in my country, when you close something, you don't fall down it. At least we can just do that. And that guy's already dead, and we jump, 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 sorry. And we jump across. Yay! And up and over. And that was close. And we go down here, and there is a mad mushroom down here. I remember seeing it. So just take your time. There it is. Hello! Boing. If you're really daring, you could try to get back across before it lands from the first time. And yeah, it opened that up, so let's go check out where that leads. I'm predicting that it leads to another gem, that leads to another area, that leads somewhere else. And yeah, it leads to him, of course. Because why wouldn't it? Oh my god, there are two of them. There are two of them. And this obviously leads to a... Uh... Oh, that... Okay, I know where we are now. We're here again. Don't you love places that loop back upon themselves? Because I don't. So now that we've avoided all that stuff, I think we can actually try to exit the level. I don't know if this level has a uh, council member or what, but let's go check it out. I'm just going to take this slowly. Look at that. That is called lazy editing. Actually, it's not, because technically it is a, you know, stop, place, thing, person, die. <clears throat> yeah, so I don't remember, I, I don't think there's a council member, because I'm pretty sure there's a council member in the, uh, I don't know, I, I, oh no, it's an exit, and you can obviously take the upper route if you're really lucky at jumping, but I wouldn't try it. <gasps> life, life water. Actually, yeah, what you're supposed to do here, which is actually kind of interesting. Um, you have to, like, try to jump from the... Uh, I'm going to get that life, whether I like it or not. No! You have to, like, get, jump from the edge. Uh. Yes! Do -do 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 -do. It didn't make the noise, so I made it for it. And goodbye, tar pits! You don't actually have to do the levels here that are unnecessary, meaning they don't have uh, council members, but I'm, gonna do, I, I'm doing them anyway. So in the next episode, we're going to go to some uh, new scenery, namely the...
sun, moon, and eye pyramids. Well, not, we're not going to do the eye pyramid. We'll do that in the last episode along with the hand pyramid. But, uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. This has been Sephiroth Level 4 with Commander Keen 4, Seeker of the Oracle. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.